I am annoyed. I'm really, really annoyed. I spent pretty much all of Saturday trying to make a video for this series on this server. And it just didn't work out because there was no video on Sunday, you may have noticed. Well, here's the thing. I spent like four hours flying around on my RG, which is a pretty slow flyer, to be fair. It's, it's not extremely fast, so getting around takes quite some time. I spent all that time flying around looking for beehives so I could get myself some honey, so I could make the kibble to raise up the giga, and the honey wasn't even going to be a major part of the video. I was probably literally going to just start off by like grabbing some honey just to show that I'm getting it, and then, you know, head back, make the kibble, and then hatch the giga and raise that thing up. So that was the whole plan, right? I could not find a single beehive in four hours of flying around. It got to the point where I was just like, do they even exist? Have I ever actually seen one in this series? And I'm, I'm certain that I have, but at the same time, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that was a different series. Maybe I'm going crazy. I might be going crazy. I probably did go crazy, but here's the thing, okay? Then it got to the point where I was like, okay, I need to know if they actually exist. So I spawned myself in a transmitter and then used the dino scan function. I had it on my hotbar right here. And I needed to know, do bees exist? And right here, you can see that they do exist. And look at, look how many there are. Look how many there are on this server right now. These are all the exact locations. We can see them on the map and everything. Let me tell you right now, these bees don't actually exist, okay? I feel like this is a whole Pepe Sylvia thing right now because they actually don't even exist. <laughs> I went to those locations, those exact locations, down to the, down to the freaking like, dot right here, okay? And there were no beehives at all. So, then it got to the point where I was thinking, okay, they must be invisible. They obviously are not here, they don't exist or something. And then I was like, you know what, like, I've spent so long playing and, like, not even actually starting off the video. I have other things to do. I have PC stuff to set up, and I was just too frustrated. So I was like, you know what, I can't make the video for Sunday. I just can't do it, which really pissed me off because I never like missing a weekend slot. Like, if I'm going to miss a day, I'd prefer it be a weekday. I haven't missed a weekend day in a long, long time. So yeah, that's why there was no video on Sunday, but there is a video now because guess what? You're watching it. Here's the thing. I feel like the mod dev and I have some sort of telepathic link because then on Sunday, guess what happened? I don't even understand. Maybe bees had never existed and there was no way to get honey. I have no clue, but right here you can make honeycomb uh, moral. Uh, which is basically just a mushroom that could be used as kind of like an XP bonus thing, but also can be used as honey in recipes. And all it costs is angler gel, which, to be honest, is a... Wait, what? Did I not just put some in there? Did I... Oh, did it instantly start crap? That was weird. Let me just put a bunch in there. Um, so I don't, I don't exactly know what happens here. I, I thought it would just instantly... Or I thought we could, like, craft it, but I guess it has to take a little while to turn into honey. This is literally going to be our only way of actually making honey, so I might as well make a bunch of these nests, and we're going to need some more angler gel. Guys, welcome back to the Hunted server, the Hunted series. Make sure that you hit the like button. It would really cheer me up on a Tuesday, which is when this video should be coming out. We're going to need some more angler gel before we raise up this freaking giga. Like, the, the honey, man. Like, I I, uh, I don't even understand. Like, do they ever actually exist? Can somebody find me a timestamp in one of these videos when there actually was a beehive? because I don't remember at this stage. We have 16 left, and we're still gonna need some to hatch up the eggs. So we can't use all of it, but we do need to head into the water to basically go ahead and get more. And I figured that we'd be doing that, so I brought some stuff to place onto my raft, and we're also gonna need a little bit of, what do you call it, um, Lazarus Chowder. There we go. My, my brain is so fried right now because I logged on, and like, I literally, I read the patch notes and I'm like, oh my god, are you kidding me? So I log on and I see that and I'm just thinking, well, great, this would have been this would have been really handy on Saturday because I could have made the video and not disappointed people. <laughs> so yeah, um, we need three honey for for a piece of kibble. You can also see that it's specifically needed for this recipe right here for the uh, exceptional one. So we're gonna need to basically make a bunch of this because at this stage we need a bunch of that. That used to be sap, so it's replaced sap in the exceptional kibble recipe. Has anything else changed? I don't think so. I'm so glad that the little narrow leaf uh, hasn't been added to any of these recipes because I have yet to find one of those. Actually, I think somebody wrote what nest they're in and I can't remember what it is now. All right, well, anyway, um, we're thirsty. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and make some Lazarus Chowder. We're gonna head back into the water with our Baryonyx and hopefully not die to anything bad. 
there's obviously mosas and two toes and all all sorts of bad stuff down there so if i lose this barry we're just we're just toast i'm just probably gonna quit the whole series not really but we'll see um <laughs> all right well anyway let me go ahead and just get some stuff ready here and then we'll head down oh by the way one more thing went ahead and actually just pulled out this pistol because i went ahead and just crafted up a bunch of ammo for it we have 300 ammo i actually have yet to try it out i believe i was actually going to try that out on the uh the episode i was going to make for sunday and actually i don't worry i'm not going to abuse this at all i'm going to go ahead and get rid of that transmitter after uh i just i needed to know about the bees okay my parents never taught me so i know about the birds just not the bees and anyway we need food but quickly is there anything i could shoot probably not because i got into a bit of a frustration rage and just went around and killed everything in this whole area we do have a t-rex that's new that thing was not there before uh we're gonna need to take care of that um all right well anyway water thing first let's do that first all right do we have any of this stuff yet uh no oh my god that's gonna take ages to craft no I'm not happy about that. I still don't even think we're actually going to get this Giga raised up in this episode, by the way. I feel like we're probably going to have to deal with all of this. You see, like, I could probably skim through all this stuff, but I've definitely found from this series specifically, people really enjoy when I include pretty much everything. So mundane tasks like this could be considered exciting, especially the fact that, you know, there's dangerous stuff down the water and we're probably going to die. So my God, that Rex is getting closer. I feel like we need to deal with that before we do anything, actually. Yeah, no, that thing is legitimately going to walk right up to my base. Yeah, look at this. We're definitely not going to get the Giga raised up today. Hopefully for the next episode. We'll see. Honestly, I'm so sorry. I didn't think any of this would be an issue. If, if I had a note about the honey, I probably would have tried to prepare. I don't even know if it existed before at this stage, though. I really don't. Um, What am I doing? What do I need? All right, let's see. Uh, I guess I could run around on the galley and just kind of like shoot at it for a little bit. I don't really know. I guess um, glass arrows would be handy, obviously. Let's, um, oh, you know what? We have one flame arrow. Let's go ahead and use that. That's our last one, actually. Oh, all right. Well, let's use it anyway. A T-Rex is a pretty good creature to use it on. Um, let's go ahead and get out here with our freaking amazing crowned galley um doesn't have a proper name technically what what happened with this one again i can't even remember now we've had so many galleys it's been ridiculous where did that t-rex go where oh there it is what the hell why didn't i see that i guess it was just blocked very strange all right let's no that's not what i want uh i was hitting the double tap just to get it onto my bar but that did not work at all all right, let's uh, go ahead and deal with this thing then. There you go. Oh my god, I forgot about that. I completely forgot. I keep forgetting. Oh, no, 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 no. Galley, follow me. No. Screw you. Passive. Ooh, this gun is not actually too shabby. Yeah, uh, completely forgot about that. Now we're in Carno Hunting Grounds. Oh, yeah, that's what it was over here that I was killing. Um, yeah, completely forgot about that one. That's interesting. Uh, all right. Let's go ahead and leave you there then. And let's just go ahead and just shoot at this nice little Rexy poo for a little while. Does the recoil affect the aim? I don't think I'm missing any shots, really. Am I? I mean, it is kind of like going really far off to the side. That thing's going to heal from that baby Carno, I assume. Okay. Here we go. Let's hit it with that. Let's keep running before it roars again. I completely forgot that they could do that. And you know what? The Alpha T-Rex could have done that that whole time, but it didn't. Very surprised about that one, to be honest. <laughs> Can't believe we actually managed to kill a full Alpha T-Rex without it doing that once. Very, very surprising. All right. Let's see. Didn't even roar at all. Like, I mean, I imagine it could probably still do this exact same ability. But yeah, didn't even do it once. Let's see. Is that thing getting bloody? It is actually kind of getting pretty bloody. I could probably kill it right now. Let's go ahead and do it. It's dance, boy. I am not, I am not interested in freaking dealing with you right now. So let's just get it over with. That's right. I know this is awful to look at. The freaking recoil on the pistols is the worst. Pew, pew. There we go. I could probably put a silencer on it to decrease that, but I kind of like the scope, to be honest. It's uh, it's also quite nice. All right. Can I take a poo in your mouth? No, can't do it right now. What about the galley? <laughs> yeah, this we've resorted to this type of childish behavior in these videos just because of the pure frustration. There we go. That's right. Right in the... Right in the lower jaw. Nice. All right, cool. Ah! Oh my god! 
This is what I get for joking around. Oh, wow. That could have been, that could have been pretty bad. Um, great. It's not even a freaking saber tooth hunting ground. They're like here. Get out of my town. What is my power sword detecting? Is it these guys? No, that's not working. <laughs> All right, let me let me try and get some headshots on these boys because uh, it's pretty easy to kill them if you do that. I mean, that one already started running because I did a little headshot on it. Were you eating my T-Rex? That's mine. I don't even care for the gamma uh, hand things that it has, but like still, it's about the principle of it. It's not yours. You can't have that. All right, let's see. Let's get over here. Just try and eh, deal with this a little bit. Okay, there's a lot of them. Pew, 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 pew. We're just gonna spray a little bit. It's kind of the worst to shoot. There we go. We got one. There's another one there. I'm just incapable of hitting it apparently. Oh, there we go. Sweet. All right. Let's uh, deal with that one because it's running towards me again. Boom. There we go. Nice. Level 90 killed. Boom. All right. Sweet. We're getting all the kills right now. There we go. Sweet. All right, sweet. We're, yeah, we got them killed. Nice. Now I can actually do things that I wanted to do. So I'm going to quickly just harvest up the, the arms off this T-Rex because... Oh my god, there's another one. Another secret saber. Just hiding inside the T-Rex. It thinks that it's his. It's mine, though. You can't have that. I'm, I'm being serious. No. Mine. <laughs> is that it? Like, is there any more sabers? I don't even have a hatchet on me. All right, whatever. You know what? I don't even care about them. Let's just, let's get down to the water. Let's do what we needed to do. Stay focused. Stay on target here today. Um, I'll get them after maybe. We'll see. Uh, what is my, what is my parasaur picking up? Is there something new over here? Cause like, I don't actually know. Let me quickly just chuck away all these items first though. Uh, that galley is following me for sure. All right, there we go. So we got our berries as well, by the way. Um, I went ahead and made three Lazarus Chowder. I chucked one directly into the preserving bin because then we would go ahead and have a uh, perfectly um, good one in there. Just in case, like, the other ones that I have here will spoil a bunch. Uh, what exactly are these guys? Are these baby sabers? Oh, hell yeah. I actually might go ahead and tame some of these guys at some point. Maybe we could do that later. Uh, this one here is not a baby saber, though, so I'm going to go ahead and kill it. Uh, I will maybe come after those babies at some point. We'll see. Why is this nest suddenly an issue? Why is that suddenly peeking up on the thing? All right, you know what? Doesn't matter. Let's get down to the water. Let's do what we need to do. Nothing else will will distract me from what I need to do, which is getting down here. I've just realized, oh my God, this would have... Oh, wow. Okay, no. I'm so glad that I did kill that T-Rex because I've just realized it. Do you guys... I bet nobody knows what I've remember that I definitely need <laughs> I need a hatchet I need a hatchet not for that t-rex for the angler fish I definitely need a hatchet oh man all right let's see let's go ahead and grab one it's just it's one of those episodes uh yeah <laughs> oh man yeah let's see uh how how well done is this is it is it almost one full piece no not really not even much further along all right cool uh, I don't know if that's going to continue crafting when we're gone, though. I really hope it is, because I don't want to have to sit here the whole time. We're probably going to have to make a, a couple more of those. Um, yeah, we're definitely going to need to have to do that. But yeah, we'll get there. We'll do that at some other point. We'll just farm up a bunch of those honeycomb uh, mushroom things, and we'll be good to go when we need them. And at this stage, maybe I should grab this T-Rex arms, but I'll grab them on the way back. Let's get down here. Uh, whereabouts is my raft? I know it's somewhere along here. I just don't know exactly where. I think it might be down by this little spot over here. Um, okay, please don't be like a giga or something bad down here. You know there's there's going to be something. Just considering the fact that I'm like, you know, I'm trying to do this thing. And the art gods are like throwing little things at me just to try and mess me up or whatever. Where the hell is my raft? Where is the raft uh if it's not over here oh there it is okay good i was getting a little bit worried there just a little bit okay let's see so um i do remember heather was saying there was some issue with her not being able to build actual structures and rafts okay seems to just be a her issue so i'm glad about that uh let's just go ahead and get these placed down this is simply just so i can get my barry back onto the raft don't really technically need these but if i want to get the barry back on it's going to be essential um 
let's see let's get you onto the little raft and let's have a little sail okay uh oh interesting maybe this is what she was talking about seriously <laughs> wait what no come on really really okay that's gonna be one of those yeah it's gonna be one of those uh well you know what maybe i could place these when we're out there if i'm not able to actually build on this raft properly i don't even understand like yeah that's just not okay cool um let's see uh we're gonna need to get you on properly yeah that is so odd all right you know what it's fine because we can go ahead and we can just place those out there when we do need to get onto the raft with the barry and then we can pick them back up again okay let's get to it we need to find roughly i would say pretty much the same area that i was at before i don't exactly know where that is but we need to find that spot <gasps> oh god no <laughs> why why is there one like right beside where i kind of sort of want to be oh my god freaking moses man like why are they a thing they're so high up and everything that's terrifying oh it's it they don't attack rafts in this mod do they they probably do doesn't look like it's going to that's good uh what level is that just out of curiosity i always like to know how i'm gonna die uh <laughs> oh it's a level 135 okay i uh, don't know why i hopped back off oh yeah because i got messed up because of the spyglass cool um all right great so that's scary that's terrifying um i don't want to have to deal with that so let's just keep going out i'm not exactly sure how far i was i know it was a good distance from the shore so let's just keep going along here and then maybe we can head down at some point I feel like I was much further. I, what is that? Is that that little rock that's like out here? I feel like that might be. Uh, is this a good spot to go down? Maybe. Perhaps. Uh, let me just have a little peek. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there any angler fish? Just about. I can't see any. Really hoping this goes well for us. So. I don't know. We should probably try and at least kill three of them if I can. I don't know if we can, though. That's the thing. So, all right. Let's uh, let's do this then. So, first of all, take a little nibble. Drop one of these. And then hop into the water. Let's do this. Okay. So, I have much more oxygen this time than I did the last time. Last time, obviously, I only had, I think, 70 oxygen stat. Now, I have 150, which is great. You get 20 points when you pump into it. So, it's definitely worth pumping just a few levels in if you can uh you know in this mod i definitely respect some more stats that i don't usually pump into um so it's kind of nice to just have like a bunch of stats just pumped up just a little bit uh okay we're, we're doing pretty good here i still don't see any angler fish though i feel like we were further out because this water's deep but it's not that deep and also there's like literally nothing down here just a bunch of fish god damn it okay Oh, this is making me nervous now. Because, like, if a Mosa comes for me, like, I I will not be able to get away. I'll probably end up just dying. Or having to sacrifice my Barry because, you know, it just won't be able to survive. Uh, oh, no, 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 no. That's probably that Mosa from earlier. Okay, it's, it's not coming for me, though. We're good. Right? That wasn't coming for me. It, it didn't start turning towards me, right? Right? I think we're good. It's not... I can't see it, so... <laughs> Whereabouts is my raft? Just out of curiosity. There it is. Okay. <laughs> okay we're good stop freaking out we're fine everything's gonna be okay uh all right great so let me go ahead and make myself a lovely little ramp i think i understand what that's from like why it's you know acting like this it's an s plus setting well not really a setting just like something in s plus where basically you can just build in the sky it's kind of cool but like at the same time it's just messing up other stuff i don't know if it's if this is a I don't really understand, to be honest. Uh, can I get onto this freaking raft, please? I just, I don't seem to be able to. Let me just do a full, just a little line up here, and then we'll swim directly at this. Oh, okay. Flew right up into the sky there. That's cool. Uh, so next time we should be a little bit more cautious of where we are, um, and just make sure that we're like roughly in a good area to find some anglerfish. Uh, I don't really know if we'll be able to see them from the surface. Last time I couldn't see anything, so I just had to, like, pretty much dive down randomly. Um, but yeah, there's this whole big shelf thing here. I definitely wasn't... I don't think I went over that. Don't think so. So let me... Let me just 
go further in this direction. I feel like we were further over here, so I don't know. We're just going to try and find that area from the last time uh, that we were down here, which was probably like 10 episodes ago at this stage, but I'm going to try and find it anyway. All right, so we have an anglerfish. Uh, in fact, is that? No, that's okay. That's a manta. Um, I have my boat just up there. I wanted to be sure that I could actually find some before I dropped my Lazarus chowder. But I just went up and grabbed a little breath of water. What is that? That's a shark. Um, Megalodon, whatever. Uh, let's go ahead and try and kill this thing then. So we got to make sure that we don't accidentally uh, harvest it by accident. Because if we... Yeah, we got to be careful here. Ooh, okay. Barry kind of ate it just a little bit. Here's the issue with the Barry, right? Uh, when you kill something, they pretty much just automatically harvest it. So... It's, it's great in some circumstances, but in this type of mod, it's not great. That is not very handy at all. Because if I accidentally bite it again, it will just completely disappear. It will get fully eaten. So let me just make sure we're okay here. I think we're good. All right, come on. You better have some good amount of angler gel for me because this took a long time to find at least one. Boom. 23. Okay. Not, not fantastic. Not the worst, though. Okay, well, there's one. Is there more? I mean, angler gel or angler gel. Angler fish aren't really like a pack creature. We just got to take a little look around to see if we can spot some more while I still have this Lazarus chowder on. Um, speaking of, let's go ahead and drop a couple of those just so we can get our oxygen back up. There's another one there. What is that? That's a Dunkley. Okay, cool. Um, we're still good, though, right? Oh, that looks like a shelf over there. Hmm. We got to be cautious about that. Gotta be very cautious because there could be some bad things down there. You never know. Um, are we good? I think we might be okay here. So let's go ahead and get this thing killed. A uh, boom. You get one of those. All right, we'll level you there, bud. Uh, 25. I think the last one was 50, right? Ooh, okay. Oh, ooh, no, 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 no. You don't get to just come over here and do that. You need to stay away. Okay, this is my kill. In fact, you know what? Let's go ahead and just kill you two. Uh, are you dying? I can't really tell. You're level 90. Okay. Please don't eat my anglerfish. This is my lunch. Get your own. <laughs> There's another. There's a bunch of sharks coming now. I spilled blood in the water. I shouldn't have done this. This was a mistake. Come on. Let's go ahead and stun it again. Oh, no. They're going to eat the anglerfish. I know it. It's going to happen, right? Better not eat my freaking anglerfish. Come on, go away. Okay, good. They're just coming for me. I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing, though, to be fair. Uh, we need some stam on this barry. Do they gain stam in the water? They do. Okay, that's good. Let's go ahead and get a stun going here uh, on both of them. And that one is not stunned anymore. Great. Uh, we need to get these dudes killed. I did not expect to be fighting a bunch of sharks all at once. Um, oh, my God. Please die. Oh, is that another anglerfish? Oh, hell yeah. Right? That is one, right? I think we're good. All right, what is that, though? Is that a baby Mosa? It almost looks like it. Let's go ahead and get these dudes killed if I can. Um, this is a big freaking problem for me right now, though. There's so many sharks, and I'm probably not going to be able to take them out in time here. I need to just keep them stunned or something. I don't even know. We can't, we can't, we can't just go for the angler gel because the sharks are here. You know, <sighs> this is the worst. I can just swim up and get away, but like right now I'm completely out of stamina. Let's just force feed a little bit of food and then just swim up. We gotta just, we gotta bail. We gotta come back. That's what needs to happen right now. I mean, like I just, oh God, this is not good. <laughs> we need to get this dude healed a little bit more. I'm so nervous about Moses right now. Where about is my boat? Oh no. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, it's got to be around here somewhere. I couldn't have went that far. Uh, okay, let's just keep feeding. Um, I might be able to just swim back after this and, and try to get back onto uh, onto that anglerfish. Kill the other one as well. Um, all right, whereabouts? Oh, no, wait, wait, no. I'm definitely further out this way, right? Yeah, for sure. Oh, my God, I swam really far back. We're, like, further out in this direction. I'm pretty sure. Okay. Let's get a, just a good eye line of our boat, and then we'll be at least somewhat comfortable. No, you know what? Let's go back down. Let's go grab the angler gel before I lose it. There's that other angler fish there as well. Um, 
There's the dead shark. Okay, perfect. Uh, that other angler fish is eating it. We're being chased. No, not really. Let's go ahead and grab the angler gel from here. We'll kill the other one after. Um, yeah, we're good for the moment. Uh, ooh, there we go. I uh, can't really see properly. Oh, this thing is going to come for me, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. It's already on me. Ah, uh, get away. Go away. Don't eat that. I swear. Get. There you go. That's what you get. Oh, my God. More sharks. Oh, I can't catch a break. I cannot catch a freaking break. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's never going to happen. Ah, die already, you stupid sharks. I'm being serious. You need to leave. Who said you could be here? These are my oceans. <laughs> Come on. Ah, man. Are they even getting bloody? Okay, this one here looks like it's getting pretty bloody. Let's just stay here and battle and just kill them because they just need to die. They need to not be here anymore. I need to focus on getting this angler gel. You're really annoying me. <laughs> Come on. Oh, is that another angler fish? Is that the same one? I feel like that's the, that's the one that just attacked me there a minute ago. I'm just chasing the shark. I don't even care. Boom, that one's dead. Nice. Uh, oh, wait, 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 wait. No, there's two. <gasps> They're coming to me. All I had to do... Oh, dude, there's another one over there. I just saw it. All I had to do was just come into the water and they'll come to me. Amazing. Who knew? Yeah, that one over there looks like it's kind of coming in this direction too. What level's this one? I can't see. Oh, I saw it there a second ago. Not sure what it said though. Uh, level 140. Okay, cool. You probably have a good amount on you. I'm going to probably have to let this one swim away, though. Uh, unless I can stun it. Yeah, I can. Hell yeah. Okay, it's dead. Let's swim away just a little bit. Let's kill the shark. Come on. Stunned. Ugh, we're almost at a stam here on this freaking barry, but it's okay. We're just we're going to have to just kill the shark right now. I don't care that we're bleeding down the stam. There we go. Nice. One, four, five killed. All right, let's focus on this one first, and then we'll get the other ones after. Oh my god, wait, wait, wait. No, those aren't anglerfish. Those are jellies. Okay, we got to watch out for them because that's that's pretty dangerous. Let's focus on getting this and keep a little eye out. Uh, can't do that in K-mode, obviously. Uh, come on. I should have really pumped more into crafting skill to get this done quicker. This is really nerve-wracking in the water. I don't like this at all. I can't really see behind me. I can kind of see down a little bit. Yeah, maybe we should try and position properly when we try to harvest the big ones like this. Hopefully, this, this is going to give me a bunch because I really need a, a ton of this stuff right now. Let's go ahead and do that just to get ourselves just a little bit more oxygen. <laughs> Still have Laz for a minute, so we need to focus on getting... Okay, 37 is not a huge amount. Oh, my God, there's a freaking shark. <gasps> no, 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 no. Oh, you arrived just in time, didn't you? Of course you did. Look at you. You... Ass, get out of here. Go. Leave. All right. Let's get this one. I feel like we're not going to get that last angler fish. Um, let's just eat a couple of these just to get a little bit of the the uh, oxygen back before we lose our lads. Just a couple more. There we go. How are we doing on that? Yeah, we're actually gaining a ton of oxygen. These berries are great, but like they do obviously increase the torpor. You just need to make sure that you don't overeat them. Because if you do, then you're going to pass out. And passing out in the water is just death. Boom. Uh, 16. Okay, not a huge amount. Not great. But we do not have another one. Okay, I thought we did. Never mind. Uh, we have this one over here. Let's just go for this one. Let's get this one killed. How much do I have so far? Okay, 76 is good. 76 is great for now. Uh, we are... There we go. Okay, we're out of Laz. We need to watch the oxygen right now because this could be very, very dangerous. I need to make sure I do not let that get too low. We need to obviously balance the uh, torpidity as well. Okay. This anglerfish was that really annoying one that kept coming back to us, right? Come on. Come on, buddy. How hurt is it? Okay, yeah, it's dead. Nice. Okay. Are we safe? We luck to be safe right now. All right. Oh my God, this is gonna take ages to harvest. Okay, I'm gonna eat a bunch of those right now, just to get that oxygen up. Um, when it starts dropping again, I'm gonna eat some more. Okay, yeah, it's dropping. Okay, we can eat a couple more of these. All right, we're almost done with this harvest. We actually have a good view right now, which is great. 
Uh, what is that in the back? Okay, I think that was just a dead angler fish or something. Okay, come on. Almost, almost. And uh, there we go. Sweet. 30. Okay, I'll take 30. That's a good number. All right, so we might need to come back down here at some point, but for the moment, uh, I think we're good. Is that my raft? That is indeed the raft. Look at that. Absolutely fantastic play right there. Oh, man. All right. Sweet. So, uh, yeah, I'm obviously going to need more angler gel in the long run, but for the moment, we should be good. We should be fantastic to at least make a bunch of honey with this stuff. I'm really hoping it's going to give me more than one piece of honey, of this, like, little honey uh, thingy, whatever you call it, the mushroom. Um, oh, my God, this little ramp is the worst. Let's see. Okay. There we go. Nice. Okay, we did it. Okay, how much do we have now? Um, 106. Cool. Okay. Let's get all these picked up then. And let's sail back to get back to the base. And then we should be good to go. Maybe making some more of these living nests would be handy though. Um, it is, it, it's, it's not that expensive. I'm going to need to take a little bit of fertilizer and use that to obviously make the re-fertilizer. But that's okay. Oh, we seem to have kind of bugged out the raft just a little. Let me move the barry. Sometimes that fixes it, right? Okay, there we go. That fixed it? Seems to. Okay, cool. I think maybe what it is is it's just like the tail bouncing against me or something. I'm not 100% sure, but I feel like that's probably what it is. Okay, so let's just take note of like the rough area that we were in. Um, pretty much directly across from that river right there. Alrighty, so let's get back over to our base now. I swear, I, I still need to make that freaking whatever you call it, the little motorboat at some point. We have almost enough black pearls. There was some ammonites down there. I could have probably killed them. I really could have. Damn it, I should have done that. Uh, they might give those in this mod. I actually am not 100% sure if they would, but they might. I'm, yeah, if they do though, that would be fantastic to kill. Um, all right, so, oh yeah, I gotta go ahead and harvest up this T-Rex too. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and then we'll get back into the base and see if we have Oh, it's okay. It's the Karna hunting ground. And then we can see if we have any um, any honey made up already. I'm really hoping it's still crafted when we we're gone because this is going to be a real piss off if it didn't. <laughs> what the hell? There's a Dillo here. Since when? What? Why is there like all things just emerging from around this Rex? Like what? So confusing. Okay, so we're back and we have our little T-Rex arms. Let's see. Please tell me there's more than one in here. Wow. Okay. Dude, like, I've been recording for, like, almost an hour. <laughs> we don't even have one. Okay, cool. Uh, I don't know how long this is going to apparently take. Also, this thing is, like, breaking, you know, over time. This is so expensive to keep alive. Wow, okay. Great, so I guess well, that's just not going to be a thing today. Uh, do I have any superior kibble? Uh, where, do, where even is my kibble? Yeah, we do. Hell yeah, I'm going to go grab a saber. You know what? Yeah, let's go grab one. Because there's no point of not grabbing one. <laughs> there's plenty of them out there. It's definitely worth at least investing just a little bit of kibble into. I'm not sure about making a saddle for it, but let's at least grab one. Uh, where? Okay. We have some babies around here somewhere. I don't see them. Okay, there's there's the baby. Do I have it? Okay, I've got one. Where's another one? Can we get can we get in our mouth? No. Okay, I dropped the first one. That's cool. All right, whatever. We're just gonna go ahead and bring this thing into the base then, and we'll tame it up, and then maybe we'll go for another one. I don't really know. Never really thought we would go for sabers because I kept uh, running into them in in bad places, but. Uh, this baby will need to calm down probably, so let's go ahead and grab another one instead. Let's see. Okay, come on, Power Sword. There we go. There's one. Hello, little saber tooth. All right, come with me. Sweet. All right, so yeah, we're pretty much just going to have to have our, um, our little living nest going constantly. Um, so, like, obviously, I think it's pretty well known. I do turn off the server when I'm not playing because I don't really want things continuing. You know, if I don't play absolutely every single day on this server for like most of the day, then pretty much everything around me just spoils. And it's just kind of like not a not a great time, you know? Especially the fact that I then have to 
make content with a bunch of spoiled things constantly. So, yeah, um, it's going to obviously take a lot to to continuously have a ton of this honey stuff. So I'm really hoping that beehives still are existing in the world. I just don't know if they are or not. Um, we're going to have to find out. Why did I put that into slot four? Hmm, weird. All right, well, I don't know if these things are going to calm down and I can maybe... Uh, there's that one. Okay, that one seems to be... Is it running? Yeah, it is running. Okay. Probably going to need to wait for them to stop running or something. I don't really know. Uh, maybe bring their parents back alive or something. I don't... <laughs> they're probably terrified. I mean, I, I guess I would be too. If, you know, if my parents were killed and then the killer, like, picks me up with a bird and then brings me to its home. <laughs> it's very strange. All right, cool. Uh, I like this little little effect thing around the, um, the nest right now. It's pretty cool. Uh, this thing's still not even done, man. <laughs> we haven't even gotten one. Ah, all right, cool. So I'm going to have to wait a little bit. All right, so some good news. We have a mushroom. It only gave me one, though, which is a little bit disappointing. This thing will spoil in like a day, and the next one is probably like an eighth of the way there. Maybe a seventh. I'm not exactly sure. Uh, so yeah, it takes absolutely ages to craft these dudes, so we're obviously going to try and make up another living nest, but uh, they do cost 50 rare mushrooms, which is pretty expensive. I don't have a huge amount of those, but we can hit up the little... Um, the little uh, pink or purpley flowers or whatever, the like scorched earth ones, the ones that give silk, because those actually do give rare mushrooms and rare flowers, so that's going to be great. Uh, these sabers just cannot stand me at all. I, I'm trying to make them love me, but they just do not seem to like me at all, so that's great. I don't know when they will love me. Hopefully one of these days, though. Uh, let me just grab some berries from you there, bud. Just comes with them a little bit hungry. Cool, thank you. Um, yeah, so we have all three of them just running around the base. Uh, they don't actually grow up in the wild, so maybe we can go ahead and just, like, leave them here. Um, maybe one day they'll love me and they'll let me tame them, but, yeah, for the moment they will not have any of it. Um, so yeah, we're, uh, we're probably gonna maybe raise up the Giga in the next episode. I'm gonna try and make up another living nest, and then I'll go ahead and, uh, have two of them going at the same time, and... Hopefully we'll have enough honey pretty soon to at least make a good amount of kibble and then we can make a start on raising up this giga because the egg took four hours to hatch, I think, or was it two? It was a long ass time, whatever it was. Um, but yeah, it took a long ass time to hatch. So I'm imagining that the maturation cycle of a giga in this mod, even with my increased settings, is probably still going to take an absolute crap ton of time. So yeah, I'm just, I'm imagining that we're going to be here for ages anyway. So we could just maybe like grow some more mushrooms as we're growing up the giga. I don't know if it's going to work out as well as I'm hoping that it will, but we'll see. Anyway, that is going to be it for today. If you have enjoyed the video, go ahead, do me a favor, hit the like button. Boom, there we go. And um, yeah, let's end off this video in the same spot that we started it in because... Yeah, I don't know. Let's see. Boom. There we go. So yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one where hopefully we'll have this giga and we won't have any more honey issues. We'll see though. We'll see.